So for us, obstructive sleep apnea is at one end of the spectrum, and at the other end of the spectrum are people who snore. So, you know, we all snore. Now and again, we have a good night out, we come back, lie on our backs, and, you know, we're snoring away. That's okay, that's benign snoring. But when somebody is snoring every night, through the night, that actually becomes pathological. So if somebody's just snoring all night, they still can wake up in the morning feeling tired because the brain is being aroused constantly through the snoring. And not only is it affecting them, it's also affecting their bed partners and people who are in the house. So it's almost like treating two or three for the price of one when you treat mm -hmm. somebody snoring. And when you try and think about, I think there are a billion people globally who have this disorder syndrome, and only about 20% of them have been diagnosed and treated. 